think part of the allure of, of, of both drugs and entertainment is, is escape, yes, from, from my problems and my life and having to be stuck in here. I can you know, pretend I'm James Bond or pretend so. It just um, and, and it seems fine over the short haul as a, as, a way of, as a way of life. It doesn't work all that well though, no? See, it's a strange question because who would say entertainment is bad? I mean, I wouldn't say entertainment is bad. But a model of life in which, in which I have a right to be entertained all the time seems to me not to be a promising one. And one of the insidious things about it is that, so, is that entertainment is so goddamn entertaining. So like, so like imagine if imagine this show were running on American TV and I were sitting in this hotel watching it. Okay, we've got this pointy headed nerdy guy talking about this stuff, or I've got, you know, Pamela Anderson running on a beach or a hilarious hilarious comedy. Which one am I gonna watch? Every year the culture gets more and more hostile. I, and I don't mean hostile, like angry, just in di it becomes more and more difficult to ask people to read or to look at a piece of art for an hour or to listen to listen to a piece of music that's complicated and that takes work to understand because well there are a lot of reasons but be, um, particularly now in computer and internet culture everything is so fast and uh, and the faster things go the more we feed that part of ourselves but don't feed the part of ourselves that likes that likes quiet Do you watch TV I don't have a TV because if I have a TV I will watch it all the time. So there's my little confession about how, how strong I am at resisting stuff. It seems significant that we don't want things to be quiet ever anymore. And, and to me, I don't, I don't know that I could defend it, but that seems to me to have something to do with when, when you feel like you're, the purpose of your life is to gratify yourself and get things for yourself and go all the time, there's this other part of you that that's the same part that can kind of, is almost hungry for silence and quiet and thinking really hard about the same thing for maybe half an hour instead of 30 seconds that doesn't get fed at all. And it, um, it, it makes itself felt in, a, in the body in a kind of dread in here. And I, I, I don't know, what, I don't know.